It's common for students in Singapore to have tuition, and the booming tuition industry is enjoying high demand. Given the different rates which tutors charge, some tuition bills can come up to a hefty amount. But students who can't afford tuition won't lose out," said Education Minister Ng Eng Hen about two weeks ago. Increasingly, more students are receiving private tuition to supplement their education in school. This trend has triggered a public outcry about the tuition culture in Singapore and the implications it has on children from poorer families. Seventeen-year-old Ko Sheng Jie comes from a family with a monthly income of less than two thousand dollars. Fortunately for him. He sought help from the Chinese Development Assistance Council, or CDAC, since he was in primary four. I heard that、uh, many students who have attended CDAC lessons they scored well, and this prompted me to attend CDAC lessons also. And on top of that, my parents have also encouraged me to attend CDAC lessons. How much do you pay per month then for each subject at CDAC? Oh,、um, for per、uh, per subject, my parents only paid twelve dollars per month. Yeah, that's pretty cheap, right?、Huh? Compared to like private tutors out there. Yeah, twelve dollars. Under the CDAC tuition program, Sheng Jie was able to receive math tuition for eight years at an average of about three dollars per session. I remember when I first entered CDAC, my math was band three, which is not a good one. And last year O levels, I scored A two. I'm very happy about it. Mr. Chan, right? He's very dedicated and very charismatic. We can communicate with him like as if he is our friend, and he really helped、uh, clarify my doubts. Do you feel that you might lose out, say, you know, to other students or your classmates who go to private tutors that charge a lot of money and guarantee them A grades? Of course not, because CDC have tutors, good tutors like Mr. Chan,、mm-hmm. and it depends on the learning attitude of the student. They have to set goals and be motivated to study. So, and to understand their work. So, yeah, it doesn't really matter whether is it private tuition or public tuition. Sheng Jie is full of praise for his math tutor, Mr. Chan Fan Chu. Can you share with us why do you opt to give tuition at the CDAC?、Uh, when I was a child, I actually benefit from a slimmer tuition program in Kim Seng Community Centre, and I have、uh, because of this, I improved greatly in my studies. Um, this has motivated me to teach at CDAC,、uh, so that I can contribute back to the society.、Um, besides that, I enjoy coaching and、uh, interacting with the students. I, it gives me a lot of satisfaction to see the students doing well in the studies and、uh, improve, make significant improvements、um, in their schoolwork. Like Sheng Jie, Mr. Chan feels that students who receive subsidized tuition from self-help groups will not lose out to those who seek private tuition. I find that a lot depends on the students'、um, mindset. I mean, the students has to be、uh, sort of, tr- I mean, motivated in their own studies, and only then the tutors can bring this up to the next level to help the students、uh, to guide them the right techniques and skills so that they are able to excel well in their studies. You know, do you think that tuition is necessary for students in Singapore today? Well, I think、uh, in a way, it has become、um, very much like a way of life for the students.、Um, I think it's because that、uh, the schools generally、uh, have this,、uh, you know,、um, approach whereby they teach less and the student learn more. And a lot of is left to the students to figure out how to do things. So tuition comes in to help. To fill up this void, where the students can explore the difficult topics with the tutors and ask them for help, and at the same time, I think、uh, parents are nowadays are very busy with the work, so they have very little time for the students. So this becomes、uh, this has resulted in、um, most of the students going for tuition classes. For twelve dollars a month, Sheng Jie has managed to overcome his math monster and is currently studying in a junior college. However, you don't always get to meet responsible and reliable tutors. Should the government step in to regulate the tuition industry? More in the next clip. <laughs>